Hassan, dude. Yo, and what is going on, guys? It's your boy Rex Chu, and welcome back to a brand new video here on Simplicity RSPS. Dude, it's actually been a while since I've said those words, but I've missed this server so much. Their content is incredible on here, and today's video is absolutely insane. But before we hop into that, I actually want to tell you guys about a giveaway we are going to be doing for three lucky winners. We're actually going to give away a Sang and SD staff to win winner, a Raids Cape to the second winner, and a Superior Trex Zook pet to the third winner i don't know if i said that right that's literally a hard word for me but if you guys want to enter into that giveaway make sure and like the video comment down below your simplicity ign and subscribe to the channel three different winners for like some insane rewards so make sure and enter right now guys show all the love you can but also if you're the first comment on today's video you'll be receiving yourself a sapphire mystery box as well if you're the first comment on every other video you'll get a prize as well so always be notified but guys make sure and stick around for today's video we have some intensity ahead of you a lot of hype and a lot of excitement so i hope you guys enjoy today's video So for today's video, I wanted to twist it up a little bit. We are going to be wearing the best in slot range gear and weapon that was just released in the brand new update. Literally like yesterday, they came out with the light ceramic set and the ceramic twisted bow, giving me a total of 1280 range bonus. I've literally never seen that, and I love that they actually have that much fucking bonus with it. The special attack is absolutely insane with the set as well, guys. I'll be showing you that later. It has two hits. You can hit like 200, 200 with this bad boy so it's going to be intense and it's going to be lit also with this set you do get a five percent drop rate bonus and plenty of other benefits so it's so worth it we're just doing regular raids right now as you can see dude but there's literally so many people that this is going to take no time this should be super easy dude look at this man fpk merc height simplicity gang gay gang let's get it dude honestly i could literally do this raid in this gear alone with like one other person or even solo because of how op this gear actually is the spec on this is fucking mad, boys. I'll be showing you that in just a moment. I don't think we should have a problem with dying. There's literally so many people in this raid right now. I'm actually excited to check out the Theater of Blood as well, but hopefully we can get us a rare drop. We have 50% extra drop rate boost for this as well. Like, Kevin's actually hosting it, which is the owner, giving everybody an extra drop rate boost. This is one of the biggest raids I've ever seen. Let's go ahead and test out this little spec real quick. It's actually fucking insane, boys. It hits twice, but it hits like 200 pluses. Like, it's literally so fucking mad. Here we go. Look at that, dude. <laughs> fucking crushed, dude. We literally just two-piece that. Holy crap, bro. I've never seen a raid go by so easy. Like, no difficulty. I only have food, really, and, like, we're just slapping through it. Wow. Okay, the raid is over, boys. That literally took, like, I'm not even gonna lie, like, a minute and a half, if that. We got literally 800 death runes and 4,000 coal. F. By the way, I know it's been a while since I've been on Simplicity, but their content is literally the best content I've ever seen. Dude, I literally love their gear. I love their mix. They have the pre-EOC mix with like old school custom items. Literally, it's just so perfect. Like this gear setup alone literally says a lot about like what their server offers and their player count 272 online right now. And this raid mass is fucking huge. Like I've said it five times because I've literally never been in a raid this big. And we have the other boy, FPK Merc, in here as well. Another YouTuber. So this is pretty hype. Not gonna lie. Jeez, there's a second one over with already. 36 Dragon Fire Arrows. And we got 2,160 coal again. All right, can the third raid be the charm, boys? Wish me luck. Cross the fingers. There's so many people. Not too sure if anybody else got one on the last salute. I don't think anybody's actually gotten a good rare yet. With that extra 50% drop rate boost, kind of... I mean, even only doing two, it's still kind of like... Damn, I figured somebody would have gotten lucky within the first two with that extra drop rate boost. But we have so many more to go. This is going to be going for quite a while, as I can see. Like, we have just so many people actually hyped for this right now. So, hopefully we can get us something good. Oh, Mitch got a fucking Elder Maul. You lucky bastard, dude. And we didn't get anything. Unfortunately, third time wasn't the charm. Literally, Elho said, imagine somebody dying. Like, bro, for real. If you die in here, yo. But, but, what? Oh, yeah, yeah, I thought you were gonna die, dude. I thought she was dead. I was like, why is an 84 in here anyways? But she actually survived that. Bro, no fucking way. We just got an orb of light. I didn't even notice that. Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Let's go. <laughs> 
literally I didn't even notice that until like a little bit after the raid I see people spamming and my boy your boy wrecked you pulls out the fucking rare dude the orb of light my RNG blessed me blessed me they fucking blessed me let's go simp gang I don't even have a clue how much an orb of light is but that was so freaking rare dude everybody tripped that as I got it as well I was confused for a moment I was like just finishing the raid up and I was like alright you know, another probably bad loot. Let me pull out the Orb of Light. My mind was actually freaking blown for a second there. Like, I'm so confused right now how we just got that on the fourth raid, by the way. Orb of Light, let's go, dude. Oh, fucking feels good. Great video already got us rare on the fourth kill, dude. Like, hell yeah. Oh, very nice. We actually used the Orb of Light to make, like, the Ice Twisted Bow and things like that. So, very unique. We didn't get anything on a back-to-back, -back, though. I don't think. Let's see. Let's see. All right, we got Admin Ore and some Grimy Renar. No freaking way. I just found out that that drop was actually the best drop from the raids as well. If that's true, holy shit, boys. We just made bank. Holy crap. Okay, there we go with our sixth raid complete. Nobody got anything, I don't think, from like an actual, you know, yell anyways. So nobody's getting lucky right now. Your boy still did with the Orb of Light. Feels good. Seventh raid complete. Still some unfortunate loot. Somebody in the chat was just asking if this is going to be the last one. Hopefully not because I don't see anybody else really getting anything too OP yet. I don't want to be the only one coming out of here with an OP orb of light drop. I want somebody else to participate in the OP drops with me. So come on boys. Get the RNG up. Let's go. 50% extra drop rate boost right now. Somebody else should get a rare like at least. Ah oh, shit. Here we go. Good luck boys. Final wave. Everybody's saying good luck. Good luck. Hopefully I'll just RNG each other. Good luck homies. Oh, Ancestral Rope Top. Yo, Wad, which is like actually one of the staff members I'm pretty sure just got that. Grats, dude. And we got some herbs. All right, so basically since the Mash Raid didn't last too long, I'm going to be hosting my own Theater of Blood real quick, which is a little more difficult, and we don't have a huge fucking mass, of course. We only have like five people in this one, which is still huge because that's actually like the maximum capacity you can even have. Add the best in slot range gear, and we're going to be doing one of the end boss ones. You can't do a full Theater of Blood. As you can see right here, or the Verzik Vetter. We're going to do the regular one, like the second one. There's only like two rooms to this one, so it shouldn't be too bad. We're doing the final challenge. And I'm pretty sure a lot of you aren't really too aware like how the boss works yet. But basically, do not let the orb hit you. Like, you stand behind the pillars, and then you attack when he isn't attacking himself. You'll see them little orbs go, and that's when you want to go up and attack. But then basically, when he comes back and attacks, you want to be behind the pillar. Because you could get one hit. You can literally get one tap. That guy got hit an 83 right there. So it's definitely one that you need to, you know, focus and pay attention with. But it shouldn't be too terrible once you get the hang of it. Look, I just got hit with an 80 right there. My ass wasn't paying attention, boys. But yeah, very simple room. Just stand behind the pillars. Don't get hit. Because like I said, the one hits are very frequent. 109 that guy just got slapped with. All right, now in this one, I'm not too sure how it like keeps working. But keep moving. Yeah, I know you keep moving in this phase for sure. So let's just try it out. Yeah, so as you can see, it's pretty much a simple raid. You just kind of stand here on this phase. Oh, as I said that, bro, <laughs> we fucking died. Holy shit. How did I die, dude? The boss literally died, and I die when the boss dies. That makes no sense. All right. Well, fuck. We're back, dude. <laughs> All right, good luck. Loot the chest. There's an arrow on the chest you actually loot, so come on. F loot, but I'll take it. Dragon arrows and some uncut emeralds. Let's go, baby. We're gonna do a second one real quick. We gotta get the redemption, dude. That thing killed me as it died. And if I was actually just looking, I wouldn't have died. I was literally telling you guys how simple it is, and then I die. Like, bro, what's my problem? Retard over here, but <laughs> let's go into the door and uh, you know, give it a rego. Holy shit, dude, we almost just died right there. Thing hit me super fucking hard. Alright, it's almost dead though. Redemption is almost taken. We can't we just can't die literally right when it dies again and we'll be good. There we go, baby. Give me them boss points also. Let's go see what our loot is. And we got ourselves some more pretty ass loot, dude. Hey, let's go. Your boy got MVP on this one as well for performance. You know how I do. You know how I do. We got this boys. But the loot again was pretty ass. But anyways, that was actually super fun. These raids on simplicity are crazy. Whether you're doing theater of blood, regular raids, the regular raid mass was wild. We got the orb of light. Cannot believe that, dude. But guys, yeah, if you want to check out the performance, come over here to the little strategy table after the raid or daring. It's somewhere. I'm pretty sure it's just in this room after. So come over here and check that out. You can see like how the performance was from each player. Pretty unique. 
and yeah but dude that was actually super fun i had a great time anyways guys that seems like a great place to wrap up today's simplicity video if you enjoyed please by all means show all the love you can subscribe to the channel as well we are so close to that 5k mark and i would love to get it asap so show all the love you can guys and also come check out simplicity with the links down below we have a great giveaway to three lucky winners in the first comment getting that sapphire mystery box so make sure and hop a line and enter to that giveaway right now guys but i love you all i'll see you on the next simplicity video and have a great day